Geisbrecht van Amstel, by Joost van den Vondel is a masterpiece of Dutch Renaissance drama, encapsulating themes of loyalty, honor, and the struggle for power. Set against the backdrop of the fall of Amsterdam to the invading army of the Bishop of Utrecht, the play delves deep into the psyche of its characters, exploring their motivations and conflicts amidst the chaos of war. At its core, the play revolves around the character of Geisbrecht van Amstel, the noble leader of Amsterdam, who faces the daunting task of defending his city against the forces of the bishop. Geisbrecht emerges as a symbol of steadfastness and resilience, committed to protecting his people and upholding his principles even in the face of overwhelming odds. His unwavering determination and sense of duty serve as a beacon of hope amidst the turmoil engulfing Amsterdam. Van den Vondel skillfully portrays the internal struggles of Geisbrecht as he grapples with the moral dilemmas presented by the siege. Despite his desire for peace, he is torn between his loyalty to his city and his longing for his homeland, which lies beyond the besieged walls. This conflict adds depth to Geisbrecht's character, humanizing him and making his struggles relatable to the audience. The play also explores themes of betrayal and treachery through the character of Vosmir, a former friend of Geisbrecht who ultimately betrays him to the bishop's army. Vosmir's betrayal serves as a cautionary tale, highlighting the dangers of ambition and the corrosive effects of envy and resentment. His actions contribute to the sense of tension and suspense that permeates the play, as Geisbrecht and his allies must constantly be wary of betrayal from within their own ranks. Central to the narrative is the character of Bade Locke, Geisbrecht's wife whose steadfast faith and unwavering support serve as a source of strength for her husband. Despite the hardships they face, Badelock remains resolute in her commitment to Geisbrecht and their cause, providing a counterbalance to the treachery and deceit that surround them. Her presence adds a touch of poignancy to the play, underscoring the human cost of war and the sacrifices made in the name of honor and duty. Van den Vondel employs rich symbolism and imagery throughout the play to enhance its thematic depth and emotional resonance. The recurring motif of fire serves as a powerful symbol of destruction and renewal, mirroring the devastation wrought by war and the resilience of the human spirit in the face of adversity. Similarly, the imagery of light and darkness underscores the contrast between hope and despair, highlighting the transformative power of faith and perseverance. The play's dramatic structure is marked by a series of tense confrontations and stirring speeches, culminating in a climactic battle scene that showcases Geisbrecht's bravery and leadership. Van den Vondel's masterful use of language and verse imbues these scenes with a sense of urgency and intensity, drawing the audience into the heart of the action and heightening the emotional impact of the play's climax. In conclusion, Geisbrecht van Amstel is a timeless work of literature that continues to resonate with audiences today. Through its vivid characters, compelling narrative, and rich thematic exploration, Joost van den Vondel's play offers profound insights into the human condition and the eternal struggle for freedom and justice.